Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. Got another useful tutorial for you today. Learning how to do the double cow hitch on a six, a six strand core setup on buckles. So yeah, in the past, you know, we've done bracelets with the double cow hitch on both sides uh, with a either two strand core or four strand core. And this time we're learning the six strand core. If you know how to do the four strand one, uh, this will be very easy for you. It's just one extra step. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be very useful in an upcoming tutorial that I'm gonna do. So I wanted to share this with you guys. And uh, guys, remember, uh, if you're looking for anything used in the video, whether it be buckles, paracord, and whatnot, uh, just check out my affiliate links because I am an uh, Amazon affiliate. So anytime you guys shop through those links, you are helping me out because I receive a small commission. All right, guys, thank you uh, for tuning in. And that being said, let's get into the tutorial. Okay, so I've got my buckles set up on my jig here. I'm just using the jig for clarity, just so everything's not moving around. And also I'm using really large buckles, oversized buckles, actually, um, just to make everything nice and clear. Because uh, I would never use these buckles for a bracelet, just because they're too large. But anyways, let's get into it. So I've got my paracord here. And also this is set up a lot shorter than, um, you know, I'd actually do for a bracelet, just so I can get everything in frame. So I get, you can take your paracord, your weaving strands, you're going to double it over at the midpoint. Now we're going to bring it through the back of the uh, buckle like this. So the way we're starting this is actually just like the um, four strand core version, but with a little addition. Okay. So you got it. You bring this uh, first kind of loop down to the other side, close to the other side, like right there, because that's going to run the length of the bracelet. Uh, let's take, one strand to the left, one to the right. So now for this right strand, you're going to take uh, the right strand through this middle loop like that. Okay. That's one step. Next, you're going to kind of bring it to the right like this. Then now you're going to take the end of that strand and pass it through the back and bring it through to the front like so. And then it's going to go through this loop. And when you pull it closed like that, that'll form the first cow's hitch. Okay. So there's the first one. Now we're going to do the exact same thing on the left side. I'm going to bring the left strand through the loop in the middle here like so. I'm going to bring it out to the left this time like that. Okay. Now you're going to find your end and you're going to go through the back just like the first time and then bring it through this loop. Okay. Pull that, cinch that up. Now we have our two cow stitches on this side. So now we're going to do the similar thing on the bottom side. I'm just going to adjust this, move this up here. I actually need to move this back a little. Okay, keep that right there. Right now we're on this side. So it's almost the same thing. Uh, we're going to start with the right strand. So we're going to go through the front of the buckle like this. Okay. But now we're going to go th out through the, um, the middle of this loop here. Okay. So pull everything through like so. Keep that there and try to keep any twists out. It's okay if we have a little twist. And then now bring it to the outside like you did before. So you're just, you're doing the exact same thing now, except just on this side, bring it to this side. And now again, take this end of your paracord, bring that through and pull it through, through the loop here. Okay. You see how it goes under, pull that through. Okay. So let's pull that tight. Okay. So there's that side. Now we're going to do the same for the left side. Let's get this over here. 
Okay. Got the left strand now. We're going to go through the top of the buckle again. And we're going to do the same thing as we did. We're going to come out through the middle here like that. Okay. And I'm going to pull. Oh, sorry. You want to go over, pull all the excess through. Oh, I'm getting caught up here. Okay, so bring it to the left this time. Just like you did on the opposite side. Straight, I know, okay, bring that to the left, like so. And now bring it through the bottom of the buckle, like that, and then through this opening here. Okay, so let's do that. So we've just did this exact same thing as the um, four strand core. Now to make this the uh, six strand, it's very simple. Let me just make this a little tighter. Okay, there we go. Now, now that we've got all this done, all you have to do is bring the uh, strands back up to the top. Okay, so we have our strand on the left and right. Now you're going to loosen this one up and you're going to bring this cord through here. You can use a fit if this is too hard. Shouldn't be though, because you can just loosen it. So bring this through here like that. Okay, that's one side. And now the other side, you're going to loosen this one. See, put that through there, bring it out, and there you go. That is more or less it. Just now, uh, kind of cinch everything together, make sure all the, uh, the strands are kind of nice and taut, like so. And there you have your six-strand six core with the double cow stitch, right? This is definitely my most favorite uh, method of attaching buckles. Just having those uh, two cow stitch on each side looks really nice. And I think it makes everything look really professional, you know, nice and clean. And that's it. Um, yeah, we got our six strands. Now you can start your, you know, whatever weave you want to do from here. You can do you use this to make uh, extra thick fish tails or even, um, you know, much thicker cobra knots or cobra bracelets, right? anything you want and we're going to be using this in a upcoming tutorial so I wanted to do this uh, for you guys to make sure it's nice and clear on how to do this and that's it guys so um, yep here it is the double cow stitch on each side with the six strand core hope you guys find this useful and uh, make good use of it in your bracelet making and uh, yeah stay tuned for a future tutorial where we're going to use this setup for another awesome bracelet Guys, thank you so much for watching. Remember to check out all my affiliate links if you're looking on uh, where to get uh, paracord buckles and jigs and all this good stuff that we use in the video. Uh, yeah, check out my affiliate links because every time you guys shop through those, you are helping out the channel a lot. Okay, so thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next video.